guys, Ruben here, and guess what? Kim Kardashian surprised me today. I mean, Kim Kardashian. Hey guys, it's Kim. I am about to go inside and surprise Ruben. I'm so excited. Kim's makeup line, as you know, is very, very successful. Um, and it's gonna be like, well, it is a big, massive range. And I just love it so much, and um, I really wanna use it one day. I think you're gonna need this. Oh my god, Kim. Oh my god. <laughs> Hi, it's so nice to meet you, Ruben. Hello. Oh, you're Don't faint. Okay. I'm here. I'm here. Thank you so much. Oh my it's god. It's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I love these eyes. I want you to do my makeup one time. Yeah, I think we need to do that. We do. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to snap? Yeah, of yeah, course. Do you want a filter on this one? Of course. Yeah. I love a filter. Ellen, you set me up. Okay but I loved it. Um, I went out on the Ellen show um, and I went to go see Ellen and we talked for a little while and then she told me she had a gift for me and I was like, another one? I mean, <laughs> come on now. Someone has a gift for you. Here you go. You're so welcome. You get her makeup. You know how hard that is to get? It was just like mind blowing. Like Kim Kardashian giving me makeup? Like, are you serious? And if you don't mind me showing you, she gave me her brand new KKW fragrance. And she wrote me a message, Anya. I'm just gonna switch this up. This is so nice. So today's look is based on Kim Kardashian, Kim Kardashian inspired makeup tutorial. And it's mainly focused on the face, eyelashes, and the lips. So I hope you all stay tuned and enjoy. So the first thing we're gonna do is our foundation and Kim's skin is always very glowy. To do that, I'm gonna be using the Dojo Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. I'm just gonna do a pump of that on the back of my hand and I'm just gonna take the Josie Moran Pure Argan Oil. It helps like really blend it into the skin. I mix that in and then I'm gonna get that on the brush. So I'm just gonna put that over the redness and it's always better to start in like the center of your face and work outwards. So I'm gonna keep on blending that and I love this foundation so much because it gives the right amount of like yellow undertone without going too orange. So let the skin breathe girlfriend because it's done nothing bad to you besides what making it look beautiful. <laughs> okay, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna move on to my eyes and eyebrows. So I'm using the HD Definition eyebrow pencil and I like to start in the middle of my brow, do like little hair strokes back and forth. And I'm just gonna brush it through to make sure it really looks like natural hair. The Kiko Eyebrow Fibers Coloured Mascara. I love this so much because it gives the right amount of colour and doesn't like overdo it. I'm going to carve out my eyebrows using that 2 and 2 brush again. I'm just going to run it through. So I'm going to repeat the steps on the other side now. It's going to look totally cute. <laughs> Before I do my skin and use all the Kim K makeup, this is the Becca kind of liquid highlighter. And this is going to be like a prep. And once it sinks in, it's going to make the highlight really stand out and glow from within. So if you do your eyes first, you kind of you want to see how heavy you want to do your skin makeup. I'm gonna get um, the tart shape tape, and, and this what this will do. It will create such a good kind of base. To get the beauty blender, I use the pointy side and just really get into those like little areas. We're gonna start on the eyeshadow. So just this color over here, and I'm gonna mix it with a little bit of Eden. It's very really nice, really really natural motions into the eye from Kim's KKW makeup line. Um, I'm gonna be using the Dark Contour Cream Kit. It's so easy to use this product. I love it so much. And then I'm just gonna get my finger and just kind of blend this around. As you can see, I think it's gonna be a really nice transition, especially with that brow. We're gonna get that on the two and seven and just kind of put it on the outer edge. Oh my God, it's gonna look so good. <laughs> So the thing about Kim's makeup is that it's always blended. I mean, thanks Mario for that. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit. I'm just gonna just pop a little bit in the middle. I'm gonna be using um, Neferititi. Neferititi, I don't know how to pronounce these names. I'm putting that, oh my God, that is such a nice color. I'm gonna get MAC Fix Plus. This is gonna make the color pop and stand out. I'm gonna put the um, eyeshadow one and this is gonna make it more metallic and really like really pop. Okay, and then once you do that, I'm gonna go to the Kat Von D Shade and Light Eye Palette. Right, okay, this is kind of like a gray color. 
This is such a cute like, mini little brush. Take the tiniest, tiniest bit of black and run it in the root. So we're gonna do what the lashes now. And um, these are the <laughs> Huda Beauty Samantha lashes in the um, number seven. And I'm like obsessed with doing this. You wanna see how big the lash is? So instantly, I know that's a little bit too big for me. You just top off what you think you need to go on. And you always top off the end, not the front. So the lash I'll be using is the Duo Brush On Adhesive. This is the clear one. And Kim's lashes are always right on her lash lines. You wanna hold it on the edge like this and then blow it. Okay, and then you wanna put it right in the middle. Get the MAC Extended Play Gigapack Lash Mascara. You wanna get in the root of the lash. I'm pushing upwards. You wanna really get into the root of the lash. Okay, I'm so excited for the face now. Kim's face is just like always on point. She started the whole contour and highlight trend with, um, with like the light under eye and the dark contour. And she hasn't done it as much anymore, but I'm still gonna use, um, do it today. So I'm gonna be doing a little bit of this concealer under my eyes. The applicator is like so really creamy. And when I, when I put it like on my cupid's bow, um, if I get on my lips, it looks like really nice. Um, it makes my lip look a little bit plumper and Kim's, Kim's lip are like, they're on point girl. Um, with concealer and um, bronzer, um, bronzer and contour makes everything sink in and makes it look more shallow and, and like um, smaller. And then with the highlight um, the slash concealer, um, it makes everything look like um, more plump and everything, and the thing, and you want to see it. And then you want to kind of, you want to be careful in between the eyebrows because you don't want to get it like everywhere. The more you like pounce it in, the more like better it looks and the more blended. And the moment we've all been waiting for, <gasps> yes. Okay, so we're going to be using the KKW um, co cream contour kits, and then this is. I think this is the this is the medium one, and I'm going to be using this just right here. When the kit it comes with like the brush applicator, and and this is how it's for the concealer, the well, Sasha brightener, which I'll be showing you soon, and then this is for the bronzer. So, ooh, I kind of like this. And meeting t Kim today actually helped me realize how like how makeup was, I guess. So that was kind of helpful. <laughs> um, so I'm getting the lighter kind of color from it now, and I'm just blending that around where we put the darker kind of color. Okay, so what Kim's videos show that she does like she loves doing the um, like really bronze forehead, and then she like, goes like a three, so like this with jawline contour. Everything looks so harsh on it, so I'm excited to see what this looks like. Oh my god, this is so nice on the forehead. Oh my god, it's so nice. Okay, I'm kind of obsessed. Like, like this is like, are you serious? That's like so nice. If you put it around your lips, it makes your lips like you have a shadow, so it makes your lips bigger. <laughs> so this is the contour cream kit Kim gave me today, and it comes in the, this bag, and I mean this packaging is like to die for. Like, so thanks Kim for that. <laughs> But there's one contour stick and it has the contour colour and the bronze colour. And then the other one has the matte highlight and it has the actual highlight and I'm obsessed with the highlight. Then you get the matte highlight, which is kind of like a brightener really, I would guess. And just kind of go underneath her cheeks. I always do this no matter what and I'll sometimes bake it as well, but I don't think I'll need to if I use this. And that'll just create kind of like a really sharp cheekbone. And this will be like a natural brightener, I guess. I guess. And then and I'm just gonna get the beauty blender and just start blending this out, my girls. So um, I think Kim's done really well, just saying. I'm gonna be using the um, KKW. Um, this is the powder contour and highlight kit in the medium shade. So that's what it looks like inside and I'm loving it. I think this one's gonna be a great kind of I'm bronzing shade right here. And I'm just gonna just get into it's really like oh that's nice. That's really nice. Kind of more grey toned one. And this is gonna be so good for contouring. Yeah, so I look like I actually have cheekbones. Um so it's kind of like a Photoshop but makeup. Oh my god. He's like this is like so perfect for Instagram. Like so do you know how many selfies I'm gonna take after doing this? Like this is like perfect. What the hell? <laughs> this is like I actually look like I have cheekbones. 
Okay, so this is the, ooh, ooh. Ooh, so nice. Okay, this is like a TV highlight, so it's not like a blinding kind of Instagram highlight. This is like for like natural kind of glow. And it's not like, oh my God, thank God. It's not like a sparkly, like, oh, like glittery highlight. It's like an actual glow. So I love this product so much, this is so nice. Okay, so between this kind of contour, this shade by here, and then between that, that's like, you're set for the day, basically. Okay, unfortunately, we're done with the skin. <laughs> I'm so sad to like, leave these alone. Oh wait, we have more KKW Beauty stuff for the lips, though. Oh my god, I'm happy again. Okay, so um, we're gonna be using the, well, believe it or not, Kim Kardashian West. Um, cream liquid lipstick yeah so they're like this is the collaboration with kylie cosmetics um her sister so like <laughs> just the, the goals family the thing i can see from them is that they give coverage and they're glossy at the same time and i saw kim's lips today and they were on point and i think she was wearing um kimberly so i'm gonna wear that one and they're so creamy they're like really creamy so you can't even feel like there's anything on your lips it's like it's so light this is kimmy so Okay, we got our shade, we got the shade. Um, as far as I can tell, this is the finished look. Uh, oh no, no it's not, don't go there Ruben. I almost finished without doing my under eyes. Um, oh my God. Yeah, Kim's lashes were really long and like, like amazing. And then the final step I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take the shade Desert Sand, which is kind of like a really light color, and just put that. Oh, that's, oh my God, yes. Yes, ma'am. So this is the finished look, and this, my loves, is how you look like Kim Kardashian. <laughs> Me meeting Kim today was just the most amazing, like, amazing experience I could ever even dream of. And she's just amazing, and she's like so beautiful, and it's been my dream to meet her, so um, I'm just so surreal, it hasn't even kicked in yet. Thank you so much for watching, and um, please stay tuned for uh, more makeup tutorials from me.